And this is where we are. We're stripping the whole chassis down so we can um, get it prepped for sandblasting. So my idea with sandblasting the 40 chassis is we can get it back to a clean slate. There'll be no rust, there'll be no paint, and um, it'll just be bare metal. We can put a good underbody coating on it and we can um, rust proof it for the next 40 years. So I'm going to work from the back of the chassis forward. The engine can be one of the last things to come out. But um, in the meantime we have to get rid of the sway bars, the shockies, exhaust mounts, all that sort of stuff. You know your shockies are gone when you can do this. To get this radiator off, I'm just going to remove the shroud, get it out of the way, and then we can start on doing pipes, and um, it should just pull out. Those bolts also hold the radiator on. Didn't realise that. So we'll um, undo some pipes, drain the um, coolant out, and then pull it out. So we've only got a few more things to get out before we um, actually get the engine out. I've got to get rid of the um, drive shafts and we've got to undo the engine mounts or on this, on the back case it's probably just going to undo this plate there. Two bolts on either side and the thing will lift up. Engine mounts on the front, the radiator holder which is in pretty good nick and I think that's about it and then we can lift the engine out. So I've gone and borrowed the um, engine crane from work for a day or two so we can get this engine out of the 40 and put it on a f put it on a few tires. Now I don't really want to tell you how to do this because this is my first time doing it but um, I've got the longer ones on the two lifting mount points on the back of the engine and the front of the engine with this kind of equaliser bar in the middle. It's on the one and a half ton mark and now we'll just jack and see if everything unpops and I'll just send the chassis out and put it under my two tyres here. And that's the 2H out. Um, it was pretty tricky trying to um, get it leveled on the tyres here. 
that took probably a good half an hour to get that done, but we got it out. It's um pretty sturdy now. It's not going to go anywhere for the next month or two anyway, so... So now the chassis is all ready for sandblasting. We'll just take the engine mounts off. Well, we're ready to send it off to sandblasting. That's the 40 on the um, car trailer. We'll um, give it a trip up to the sandblasters, then um, come get it later on in the week. So it took about three weeks for this chassis to come back. Um, three weeks and it's turned out like this. Absolutely amazing. Um, in the next few episodes, we're probably going to get started on um, putting everything back on and fixing up all the other brackets that kind of, a few brackets that go under there, and then we'll start um, digging into the diffs, digging into the engine, and um, start coming together then.